Hello friends, welcome to Java Tricky Program Series. So let's see what we have for today. So here I have a simple program and I am creating a set valid codes and I am adding couple of values to it. So now let's see another way of doing the same thing. So I'll just copy it over say valid codes 1 and then I am using these double braces and I'll say add value dev and add value QA. So do you think it will work and the values in valid codes and valid codes 1 are same? So let's find it out in an Eclipse program. Okay friends, so here I, is my Eclipse and I am just creating some test class and the main method, I'll just paste the code from notepad and you see that this is not throwing any error. Now let's just do one thing. We'll print values in valid codes and then in valid codes 1. Now if I run this program, you can see that the both have same values. So it means that these three lines are same as like this one. And since here we are using double braces, so it's called double brace initialization. So it seems tricky and something that is uh, not part of JDK or we have not seen a lot. But actually it's uh, using two things here. So let's go through them one by one. So the first thing is the outer braces. So when we say set valid codes one new hash set and then the, these curly braces. So actually it's a creating a anonymous class which is a subclass of hash set. So and after that what we are actually doing is just adding one more code uh, curly braces for initialization. So we can have any more curly braces also. For example, I can divide them into two parts and this is also fine. If I run this, we will get the same output. So actually double braces initialization is nothing but having two braces where the outer one is creating the anonymous class and here subclass of hash set and then the inner brace is used to initialize the variables or we can call some methods such as hash set has this add method if uh, it would have been hash map then we can call put method like that so this is uh, uh, sometimes you will see that in some programs so don't get confused with it uh, thank you thanks for watching bye bye have a great day